Good morning, Mr. Una High. Would you please stand for the pledge? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now, let's send it over to Jack and Jackie. Good morning, Mr. Una. Today is Wednesday, the 22nd. It's an A day. Also, for all you nature lovers, it's also Earth Day. I'm Jake. And I'm Jackie. And welcome to Niski News. The makeup crew for Arsenic and Old Lace will meet in room D105 on Thursday, April 23rd after school. Today is the morning of the blood drive. Remember to bring your yellow parental consent form with you if you are 16 and have signed up to give. Let's make this day a success. Our top story today, author and New Student alumni Elizabeth Rothner will be visiting the high school this Friday during blocks two and five, and she'll also be at Java Jive that evening. She'll be discussing her novels, Gravity and Electric City. If you'd like to hear Elizabeth Rothner, check in with your English teacher, or come to Java Jive at 7 p.m. on Friday in the New Calf when she'll be reading excerpts from her novels. In other news, SAPE is running its annual Community Role Model Award. Anyone who can make a nomination, feel free to nominate your favorite role model if you feel like they are deserving of the award. It could be a teacher, coach, or staff who has a great impact on you. Nominations should be made, should be made to Ms. Pizzino in the music department to nominate your favorite community mentor. You have until May 15th to get your nominations in. In sports news, girls varsity lacrosse had a game last Saturday and beat Bethlehem 15 to seven. Nice job, girls. If you want to see them in action, they have a home game this Saturday, the 25th at 11 a.m. against Burnt Hills. Come and support our girls lacrosse team. Varsity baseball had a game last Friday against Mohanesen and won three to zero. Mike Gabriel was noted by Coach Fury for pitching an amazing two hitter. Nice job, man. Last Saturday, our Niski track team had their Warrior Track Classic Invitational. Their girls 4x100 relay and the 4x8 relay won first place. Erica Stewart got first place in the 200 meter dash. Great work, Erica. Overall, our girls placed second out of 20 schools at this meet. That's all we have for our sports news. If you are a junior and plan on going to prom on May 9th, you must complete the safety contract first. All school obligations must be met, including detentions. Prom tickets cost $65 and include three events, a walkthrough here at the high school, the prom itself at the Marriott, and the more, ap the more casual after prom at Proctor's. If you wish to only go to after prom, the cost is just $5. After prom will feature a blacklight party and a mechanical ball. There is a bake sale today in Crossroads during all lunch months. It will be 100% nut free and all the proceeds will be donated to Freedom for Life. That's all the news we have for today. On behalf of Mr. DeCesar's class, have a fantastic Earth Day.